Luke here with catsandcarp.com and I'm doing the 300 pound catfish challenge. Woo! I'm watching the sunrise on this beautiful fall morning and it's time for an epic catfishing challenge. I'm going to do the 300 pound catfish challenge. Now what this is, is I'm going to catch 300 pounds of catfish. But not just any old 300 pounds, I want to catch 100 pounds of channel catfish, 100 pounds of blue catfish, and 100 pounds of flathead. I want the 300 pound catfish trifecta. We're going to do whatever is necessary to win this challenge. And for starters, we're getting up early. Well, I'm really excited for this challenge and I want you guys to be jazzed too. So I'm telling you what I'm gonna do. If I can do this challenge, if I can catch 100 pounds of channel catfish, flathead catfish, and blue catfish, I'm gonna give away a rod and reel combo and it's gonna be nice. So let's see if I can do this thing and stay tuned for details. Seventy-five percent of my big flatheads are caught in the fall. It's a great time for all species of catfish though, especially if you're a bank fisherman. Those catfish are putting on the calories before winter and they'll come in shallow to feed and they'll feed in the daytime and they're feeding aggressively. So whether you're bank fishing or boat fishing, this is a great time to catch big catfish. There we go, come on. See how finicky that bite was? Big cat, big flathead. I'll bet you dimes to dollars. Look at this. Woo. Not a massive flathead, but I will take it. Beautiful fish. Just barely hooked. Just the way I like it. Look at that. Beautiful. Beautiful flathead. Feels like he's, you know, maybe 15 pounds. 13 to 15 pounds maybe. All right, I wanna weigh the total weight of fish that I caught, so I'm gonna use this keep net here. So check this out, okay? Big old net. We're gonna put him in the keep net. Okay. Just let him chill down there. There we go, there's a hit. This cheap piece of crap rod holder is just creaking and bending. Oh, let's get it out of there. Hey, why don't you hang out here? I got to, I got a friend for you. It's a beautiful channel catfish, and you can always tell a channel catfish because the anal fin is rounded and the tail is forked. Blue catfish have rectangular anal fins. Flathead catfish don't have forked tails. Let's get him in there with his friends. Oh, yeah. You on there? You on there? Yeah, you are. Yeah, boy. Oh, nice channel catfish. Another fat channel catfish. Oh, we got a double. Got a double. I better put this one away. Oh, triple, triple. We got a triple. First come, first serve, people. Catfish have been out hunting all night and they're now starting to settle down into their little holes and stuff like that. As this sun comes out, 
starts to hit the water, it's gonna start shutting things down. Oh, little baby one. Look at this little baby channel catfish, still has a spot. You don't see too many baby channel catfish out here. A 20 or 30 pound flathead would suck this sucker down for an easy snack. But, he still counts. Well, I'm all out of bait and it's time to go to work, so I'm gonna pull the keep net up and weigh these fish. I think we got a few. Oh, that is thirty nine pounds. All right. Here we go. Well, 39 pounds of channel catfish and 14 pounds of flathead. Not a bad way to start, but I'm out of bait and it's time to go to work. So I'm wrapping this party up and getting out of here. Hey, where are you missing? Um, yeah. Would you like to go fishing tonight? Yeah, maybe once I go to preschool, I guess. Well, once you're done with preschool? All right, I'm gonna go to work, you go to preschool, and then let's go fishing. Well, my appointments for the evening canceled. I'm done with all my work. I don't have court till tomorrow morning. I think I need to go fishing. Woo! Let's go fishing! We're going fishing! Okay, I'm done with work. I've got the boys, I've got our bait, and I'm on a new spot here. I am on a shelf where it goes from about 13 feet and drops down to about 22 feet. This shelf runs a long way and there's a lot of bait fish around. So I'm hoping I can catch some big flatheads. We'll see what happens. All right. Oh, that was a big hit right there. Well, you went and hit all the way over there. Nathan, you ate a lot of chocolate pokey. Oh boy. Oh, looks like we got another fish here. There you go, Tommy. Reel him in, buddy. Oh my gosh, he popped up. Oh, he did? Well, this spot's been interesting. We've had three fish on, about half a dozen bites, but I lost all three fish. And one of them was a blue catfish, which I really needed for this challenge. So we'll see what happens, but uh, might be a good spot if I can get my act together. There you go. There's fish on. Oh, he is all tangled up. Lift it in, buddy. Well, it's seven o'clock, the sun has set, and we need to get these little boys to bed. So we're gonna pull up our keep net and see how much uh, fish we have in the keep net. Okay, there's one and two. Nineteen pounds. So these two channel catfish are nineteen pounds. Two nice big boys. That's it. All right, so we got 19 pounds of channel catfish. Not great, but not bad either. That puts us at about 58 pounds of channel catfish, 14 pounds of flathead. Well, it's day two of my 300 pound catfish challenge and I have wet my pants. I clipped it to the wrong part! 
man, I've got to remember to attach the rope next time I launch my boat. That's, that's important. But today I am gunning for blue catfish. I'll be really happy with a big flathead, but I need blue catfish. I'm well on my way to getting my 100 pounds of channel catfish, so I really don't really need any cat channel catfish right now. I have zero blue on the board, so big blues. That's what we want. So I'm using uh, fresh uh, shad. A lot of them are live. We're gonna see whether that catches any because uh, blue catfish love, love, love shad. Look at that drag getting stripped. Oh, he's sure fighting like a flathead. Oh, look at that rod. Woo! Woo! Let's give him a little break before we pull him out and weigh him. Oh. All right, this catfish is properly gut hooked. Okay, you can see down in there. I'm gonna unguard hook him without hurting him. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna reach my hand down inside his stomach and I'm gonna rotate this circle hook out one-handed. I'm gonna go and grab the hook like this in his stomach and I'm gonna rotate it out and then work the stomach off the point gently with my thumbnail. Okay, and we're gonna get this sucker ungut hooked. Okay, where's the oh, fishing line? Easy peasy lemon squeezy, folks. That's how it's done. I figured out how to do that like a year and a half ago. And holy mackerel, just gets easier and easier. Oh, woo! That is a proper fish. Yeah, <laughs> let's weigh this sucker. 38 pounds. Oh. 38 pound flathead, what a beauty. All right, we're gonna get him back in the water. 38 pounds plus 14 pounds from yesterday, that's 52 pounds of flathead. So I'm more than halfway through my flathead portion of the challenge. I need to get some blue catfish up on the board. I'm still sitting at zero for blue catfish. Get them up, get them up, get them up off the bottom. Uh. Yeah. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Another huge flathead. Let's let's weigh this sucker up. He feels like he's low 30s. 30.1. That is a good looking flathead. Look at that. That's why they call them flatheads right there. Look at that head. All right, I think we're gonna knock this out today. We need one more flathead. Oh my goodness, I had a double and I didn't even know it. I throw that fish back and I look up and my one of my rod lines is slack. I'm like, something's going on. Oh, oh I think I got another big flathead. Oh, oh my goodness, he is not giving up. Oh, come on. Where's that net? Oh, another massive flathead. I've been here 15 minutes. This is my fourth one on, third one landed. Oh. Woo! I think this one's just a little smaller than the last one. Oh, how's that for being the smallest flathead of the night? I came so close to forgetting my scale. Luckily I had this backup scale on me. 24.3 pounds. Not too shabby at all. Woo! <laughs> Oh. 
channel. Not a bad channel catfish. I was hoping it was a blue, but it's a nice channel catfish. Not too bad at all. I'm really pleased how this trip turned out. For a couple hours of fishing on a Monday night, this this has been really great. And I've got work tomorrow morning, so I better get going. I'm gonna weigh up these channel catfish and uh, we're gonna see, uh, see what we got. 15.5, so we'll call that 15. Well, 15 pounds of channel catfish, 94 pounds of flathead catfish. 109 pounds total not a bad not a bad time for a weekday night after the kids went down all right i'm gonna go home get warmed up <laughs> it's a little cold out here especially with the wet pants <laughs> well i just got done at court and now i'm at the doctor's office getting my hand checked out now i don't know if you can see this or not but my hand is covered in catfish bites a lot of them have gotten infected. And uh, I had a, a friend of mine who just had a mini stroke because of an infected thumb. So I figured, hey, my hand's uh, swollen up a little bit. I, uh, I'm gonna get myself some gloves and I'm gonna go see the doctor. Well, I've got two types of antibiotics and a set of gloves. I'm ready to go fishing some more. Let's do this. If you like this video, stay tuned for part two of the 300 pound catfish challenge. I'll put a link in the description and we'll be posting it in just a few days. If you'd like to see more videos like this, don't forget to click subscribe to the Catfish and Carp YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.